perfect afternoon here in the Pacific Northwest. It's the birds and the trees, the loons and the timbers, and away we go. It is knockout round football. We're up against a team they had beaten a lot. But here's Reynoso. Always plenty to worry about with him. Right to Robin Luge. And the overlap from Met in the air. And it's surely there, and it is. Fragapani has struck. The Loons have lift off in the Rose City. And Minnesota United have done it again against the Timbers. Reynoso once again, the guy who plays the ball at Wyatt Met in the air. Understand where the run needs to be. Good overlapping run, good time on that run. Everybody's paying attention to the near post, nobody paying attention to the back post. Good hold up play from Robin Lute, the overlapping run from Metane, and then it's just a tapping from my kind of range at the back post. Fragabane, nobody paying attention to him, everybody paying attention at that ball being played in the near post. Steve Clark doesn't get to it. Blanco. Oh, Blanco what? Nearly hurtled into that challenge. Sort of challenge that can set off a car alarm a couple of blocks away. Quick throw. Here we go, Chara. Looking for his brother. He's found him too. And Espria had it taken away. And then the shot from Blanco. Clearing the crossbar. It's that sort of moment for the Timbers fans. It's a good initial move away from the ball from Yumi Chara. Cuts it back. You think Asprey is going to get a touch on it. Sliding challenge from World Trap and he falls to the right guy in the right position. Surely it's going to be Reynoso from this distance. It is! Oh, and Steve Clark had to react. It just feels like Steve Clark sees this late. This ball is dancing everywhere. Eventually reacts just in time to make the save. What a hit that was from Reynoso. Chara. Deciding burst into space, now a spree! Oh, that was goal bound until it was blocked. Nice touch though from Mora and Paredes was side down. It's going to be another booking. Card count is rising here. here comes the set piece, the flick on from Zupari. Oh, what a header off the line! They're appealing for a handball. It didn't look like it from where we're sitting, Ali. Being denied. The ball is not clear initially from Osvaldo Alonso. Mm. Well. Can't quite tell from that angle. We may from this angle. No. Check is complete. The corner. Sent in towards Dane Sinclair, who sees his defenders get it clear again in front of him. Severe pressure though on the Minnesota United goal and Dane Sinclair is under the spotlight at the moment. Jimmy Tara cuts to the inside, hits it, goes out and challenges the cross. Eventually coming from Claudio Rao, Lara Jimaviana gets a goal chase down for looping header, full stretch from Dane Sinclair, not getting there, 1 1, and it's well deserved from the Portland Timbers. Minnesota United have struggled with keeping possession of the ball. They were I think we've been a bit too safe. The moments we've had three or four passes and we've moved it quickly and got Ray in the little seams. We look dangerous and we look as though we could create something. I just think we've been a bit too safe. Now you really open up Portland and then you can go in transition. But if you don't give yourself the opportunity to complete those initial passes, if you don't give yourself the opportunity to sustain some pressure and force Portland to defend, then you're inviting pressure from Portland. Bravo applying some early pressure here. It's Blanco who's lucky! <laughs> Sebastian Blanco! Well, he may be ailing, he may be clutching his back, but the clutch player has opened the throttle here for the Timbers. Good fight from Dairon Asprilla, and eventually a turnover. Diego Chara steps into the pressure, no pressure on the cross, given time and space, able to pick out a pass. Chase Casper does very poorly defensively. It's an uncomfortable ball to defend, but he clears it into the middle of the 18-yard box. And Sebastián Blanco, who must have been getting massaged throughout the course of halftime, has to turn, twist, and find that far post. And what a beautiful finish it is. The target goal post camp tells us that Dave Sinclair can dive all he wants. He's never getting there. He's been kept quiet, hasn't he? Since playing a part in the opener, but that free kick finding Luch. 
just behind the intended target, and now a spree and can turn on the Jets here. Held by the side of him. Which way does he choose? He may go to his right eventually. Paredes! Oh, and Char on a full stretch. Jaroslav Niazgorda is standing by for the Timbers. Down below us, just out of your picture. Maybe Felipe Morat knowing his time is almost up. This is Blanco! Oh, yes! Simply irresistible! Sebastian Blanco is turning it on! What was an attacking play initially from Minnesota United, they turn the ball over, there's no recovery defensively from Will Trapp or Ozzy Alonso, they're all late, nobody steps up to Sebastian Blanco and says, you know what, I've done this in the playoffs, ask Sporting Kansas City if I can score from distance in a playoff, oh yes I can, oh yes I can, I'll take my first touch forward, nobody steps up to me, and this ball is dancing away from Dane St. Clair, no chance, courtesy dive, drifting away from the post and in. Nothing like easing the pain, seeing the Back of the net ripple alley is uh, that's good work from Dotson. Oh, and uh, a little back heel from Lutz. Right. Reynoso. Oh, a free header. Down and comfortable for Steve Clark. It's Portland just try and ease their way through it. Start to think about. Thanks to the day trip to Colorado, but here's Reynoso. Trying to, uh... That's floated in, and Nico Hansen had a chance to make life interesting there. You can keep it going if you're selling the idea that nobody believes in us, that we're a bunch of misfits. And a late chance there from Lourdes. They've had a couple of moments, Minnesota. The Timbers playing in front of their home crowd for the first time in three years in the playoffs. Moreno really well done, and Valeri on the ground. The finishing touch, but it matters not. The Timbers have triumphed.